Hey, welcome back to the channel. We had quite a storm last night. Lots of rain, lots of wind, and uh, we've got a few things to clean up around here today. We lost power about 14 hours ago, and uh, I, from what I can see, a tree went down right across the street. There's another one a little further down. I think they took down the line, so the crews are probably coming soon, although the app is saying uh, no update. It doesn't even say cruise dispatch yet. So I know there's bigger problems out there. So we're dealing with this. Uh, I did finally hook up the generator. Uh, you know, this house is not set up for generator. So I just ran some cords. I've got my little champion 4,500 watt dual fuel generator going, just running on gasoline today. And I just ran a hundred foot heavy duty extension cord. I've got the uh, refrigerator and the freezer going. So that's really, what's critical right now. Ultimately, I'd like to have a 220 volt connection so I could run the well pump, but for now, we're okay. You can see Lake Lucinda reappeared. It had just all but receded. I think yesterday or day before it was gone and now it's back uh, bigger than ever. So <laughs> we've got the lake back, but it'll, it'll go down again. It actually drains pretty quickly, I think, for, for as big as it is. Uh, but the, the soil, I guess, is pretty, uh, gravelly here so it'll go away but it's all right for now it's really windy today we also have a tree way down there blocking the driveway entrance it's actually not even a tree it's a limb but it came off of a tree and i've got to cut that up and get that out of the way So technically, this is a limb, although it's a good 18 inches at the base. It came up, came from up there, hard to see. I don't even remember this thing hanging off the tree for as big as it was. You don't even know where it came from, but uh, there it is, and it is pretty darn big. Looks like it's been hanging on for dear life for a while now. That top part is black and rotted, so it was hanging on here. That, I suppose, is sap. I don't want to touch it because it's going to be sticky. So I'm just going to cut the limbs off, pull them out of the way. I'm going to have to probably get the grapple and take these pieces and go throw them in the woods somewhere. I have to look at this. Oh, yeah. That is a lot. Snap.
Well, here's what I've decided. The ground is so saturated and it's just, every time I drive through it, it's making ruts and making a mess. So I'm going to just clear the driveway or leave the driveway cleared like this. I push these off to the side so we can get through. We're just gonna have to let things dry up a bit and then come back and clean this up. So for now, we can get through and uh, it's ugly, it's a mess, but that'll leave us with some good spring chipping to do. Well, I have not even walked out in the woods yet, so I don't know if we lost any trees back there. If we did, hopefully they're hardwoods that I can cut up for firewood. But these pines are just a mess, so those big pieces are gonna just stay in the corner there and eventually rot away. All these limbs we can chip up this spring, let them dry out just a bit and clean them up. But for now, I've just got to leave it here because it's just too much of a mess. Overall, we didn't do too bad here. You know, it was a lot of wind and a lot of rain, but nothing compared to the, you know, the tragedy that other parts of the country has experienced. So uh, we were lucky with this one and not too bad. So thanks for being here. Uh, I do appreciate it. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you've not yet subscribed to the channel, I invite you to join us. And as always, I look forward to seeing you next time. All we need is a place to be And a few good friends for some company If you'd like to stay, you don't have to leave We'll leave the lights on and the door unlocked If you drop on by, you don't have to knock We're happy to share whatever we've got